Mtaalamu mwingine mwambie tunza imani yako. Eh, hey, angalia huyo mwingine mwambie tunza imani yako. Praise the name of the living God. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Nyakati hizi ambapo mambo inaharibika, tukisoma Zaburi, tuweke Zaburi. Zaburi 11 mstari wa 3 inauliza swali. Nyakati hizi za mwisho, nyakati hizi za changamoto za kiuchumi, changamoto za ndoa, changamoto za kulea watoto, mambo inakani kama haiendi vizuri, maandiko inauliza swali. Zaburi 11 mstari wa 3 Inasema kama misingi ikiharibika mwenye haki atafanya si watu wote <laughs> si watu wote maana watu wengine hawana hawana makuenda amen lakini mwenye haki kuna kitu anaweza fanya haleluya praise the name of the god lakini misingi ikiharibika mambo ikiwa magumu mchumi ikiwa mgumu hali zikibadilika mwenye haki atafanya nini tusome jibu katika waibrania 10 mstari wa 38 tusome jibu 38 hadi 39 mwenye haki atafanya nini wakati mambo inakaa bila inakaa wakati hali zinaenda bila zinaenda Daladini na isi. Weka daladini na nani? Tusome. Tusome. Lakini mwenye hati wangu ataishi ai ataishi misingi kiharibika mwenye hati ataishi kwa imani. Amen. Mambo ya
hata kama misingi inaharibika praise the name of the living god wanasifiwe watu wamesita sita akuyumba yumba bwana yesu asifiwe bwana yesu asifiwe tingiza jirani mwambie usisite sita tingiza huyo mwingine mwambie usisite sita hai tingiza huyo mwingine mwambie wacha kusita sita haleluya haleluya mwambie endelea kuinua imani yako endelea kusimamia imani yako endelea kushikilia imani yako aliyekuita hajakufa aliyekuita hajabadilika aliyekuita bado yu hai aliyekuita bado anaweza shikilia imani yako ana mwenye haki ataishi kwa imani amen bwana yesu asifiwe amen bwana yesu asifiwe amen sisi tatu it is a confession yes You need to confess. It. Amen. I am not a man. Yes. Wala wana sita sita na wanapotea. Yes. But I am a man. Those who believe and they are saved. Amen. Praise the name of the living God. Amen. Na Yesu asifiwe. Wa Korinto wa pili tano mstari wa saba. Mungu amenituma nikukumbushe umuhimu wa imani yako. Usicheze na imani. Usiache kuamini. Praise the name of the living God. Continue to hold on in your faith. Mungu ni mwaminifu. Maana tuaendenda kwa imani si kwa kuona. Hello? We walk by faith not by sight. Hello? Mungu inaenda kazi by nje, but we still walk. Amen. We still move forward. Hallelujah. Maana hatuendi kwa kuona. Kwa maana kila kitu kilichodaliwa na Mungu huushinda ulimwengu. 
na huku ndiko kuushinda kuushinda kwa ulimwengu hiyo imani yetu Hello? Hiyo imani yetu praise the name of the living god the victory you need is in your faith ai hauje nisikia the victory that you need is in your faith praise the name of the living god haiko na mtu mwingine haiko na watu wengine it is in your faith amen and that's why god has sent me to encourage you to hold on on your faith hallelujah what is the spirit kwa sababu huku ndiko kunako shida ulimwengu hiyo imani yetu amen the faith that we have in our god praise the name of the living god what is the spirit amen kila kitu ndio na kushinda ulimwengu lakini ni kupitia hiyo imani yetu hiyo imani yes we possess it we have it praise the name of the lord bana yesu asifiwe ngalia jirani mwambie kwa imani utashinda kwa imani utashinda mwingine mwambie kwa imani utashinda haleluya hiyo imani yetu ndio inafanya kushinda ulimwengu ulimwengu ina mashida mingi ulimwengu ina matatizo mingi lakini kwa imani kwa imani tunashinda haleluya kwa imani tunaendelea amen kwa imani tunasonga mbele praise the name of the living god amen let us pray amen elena elena ninazi kote Amen. Watumwambia tusaidie chakula maana tunaangamia. 
Praise the name of the living God. Amen. One has the few. By faith, the invisible becomes visible. Praise the name of the living God. Amen. Number two, faith helps us to give to God better offerings. Faith helps us to give to God better offerings. Imagine to Saidia, Kumtolea Mungu, Sadaka Zilizo Bona. Sadaka Zinazo Sahili. Amen. But I saw the fewer. But I see fewer. But I think you want to end me. How are you to Tolea Mungu? What's the Mamu? How are they in Nua Imania? For Mungu, believe you. Amen. So I'm going to go on a shida. Now, Tolea. Now, to us, your best of the Kayaka. How can you attain? How can you align? Praise the name of the Lord. What do you call? Who are going to say that we're is that a better offer? Umekuliwa na changa. So na changa kambi ya papa. Wewe na kambi ya papa. Na kambi ya papa ya papa kambi. Na naspe. Ina ina mwono mwono. Ya mwono mwono. Do you give better sacrifice in God? Na mwono mwono mwono. Na mwono mwono mwono. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do you give the best? It's by faith. We give the best to God. Mani nasema kwa imani, Abel, haka mtolea mungu, sadaka hiyo mora, kuliko kaini. Na japo wamekufa, bado ananena. Amen! Kwa sababu walitoa sadaka hiyo mora, bae, fey. You should not give God sacrifices that are useless. You are tired. But that's good. But that's good. What we need to do is to spend in the bread for church. So some people are telling me, I'm going to worship. I'm going to get to my church. I'm going to get to my church. I'm going to get to my church. What is that? That is not a good sign. What is that? 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 You are there on time. Hello? You are there on time. Praise the name of the God. It is for by faith we give better sacrifices to God. Praise the name of the living God. After how many of you should go to our faith? I can say, yes, 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 Lord. I will give it to you. The best. The best. You will like to say, give God the best. Even the service that you give to God. Hello? Even when it comes to serve in the house of God, he needs the best. Amen. Karika kita uca malaki kubwa na kemina watu kwa sadakaza. Wana mletea kondo wa mazazi na haro. Kondo wa mazazi na minyo. Kondo wa mazazi na minyo. Kondo ina ina hii. Njine ni kiwe. Njine ina hii. Nasuma tukaleka sadaka kwa wana. Mungu wana sema njine lipata mungu afunge nyumba ya mungu. This was a duck as a cement. Mutu wa matikani kuwa kuke midaku. Ele ya kukuu shoke na sada kechishia. Kutini na hizo sada kaze mkwenu. Anasema chalimu upeleke chifuwebu. Mwone kama atakuwa lali na wenu. Because that is not a better sacrifice. But I just feel it. Hey, what has it viewed? Hey, what has it viewed? It's my faith we give better sacrifices to God. The faith we have in God. The trust we have in God. In Atupanya to Nasema, no, he deserves the best. He deserves the best. Praise the name of the living God. Bada is a spirit. Bada is a spirit. Ngalia kitani mwambia usiritae, ni umunyo mwambia kwa kwa pasta. Ufanya mwambia shata uko usungu uke, ala mwambia isi kile miyako mwambia seven. Ya za hivyo na kwa uni. Where is the uko mwambia? But this is good. Hey, but this is good. Give God the best. Give Him your life. Hallelujah. Give Him what you are still strong. Amen. He needs you. Praise the name of the living God. And He needs the best. It's only by faith we do that. Praise the name of the living God. Number three. Faith helps us to please God with our lives. Faith helps us to please God with our life. Maisha yetu wa tuwezi kuitumia kwa 
vya mbaya mbaya when we have that faith in God amen it helps us to please God with our lives praise the name of the living God that's why kuna mambo tutaelewa kuna mambo tutaruhusu kufanya na maisha yetu maana we have faith in God amen praise the name of the living God bwana Yesu asifiwe
Kwanza wanauliza mshahara ni pesa gani? Nyumba iko wapi? Gari, marupurupu. Hiyo kwanza wanataka ustipulate, ueleze. Love you say yes. This one. Unaweza <coughs> sasa. Wengine tutakuja hata pia kujua kama kuna marupurupu, kama kuna mshahara, kama kuna nyumba. We just came following the calling. Hello? Ufwata? Ufwata? Praise the name of the living God. Wana isa sure. Wakati nina utajua kumwa na kwa nina maisha yako. Ana kusukuma tuku kutitengeneza kanisa. Ana kusukuma kuhova. You just follow the calling by faith. Praise the name of the living God. Kengiza jirani mwambie follow the calling by faith. Mwambie fwata mwito usiyanchwe. Fwata mwito. Amen. Na unatua kati unakataa kufuata kuhito, muna kwatea na mungu. Mana isa sikuwe. Mana nasema kuwa imani, Abraham alipo hitua, haka toka, amen. Haka fuata kuhito, asijua, amen na wako. Ika ni never knew where he was going. He just followed the calling. Mungu nasema, Abraham ni come out. Toka kwa watu wei, wata kutiata, kunifuata, haka sema wata. Where am I going? Just follow me. Kwa isa nema mwadali kwa. Hey, praise the name of the living God. But that's good. Tunafuata kuhitwa kwa iman? Kwa iman. Na kila kote wetu wa meitua. Number one, tu meitua kutoka dunia. Number two, tu meitua kutumike. Hello? We have been called to serve. God. Praise the name of the living God. Sasa kuwewe uinuke kwa iman, ufuata kuhitwa. Hello? Mwefanya misu you need to follow the next call of Sabbath. But that's good. Mwitu wa mungu wa hishi na kuleta tukwa kanisa. Ana mwitu wa mwingine wa utumishi. Amen. There is a place that only you can do. Hallelujah. Kuna nafasi kwa kanisa. Amen. But that's good. And it is only by faith you follow the calling. Kuna siku nyingi utaishi kwa kanisa ukimwaja tu kwenda vinguni. Watu wengi wameishi wanakwenda tu kwenda vinguni. Kama Mungu alikuwa na haja sana ya sisi kwenda vinguni, ungekuwa unaokokaka ukimaliza kusema amen na chomo. Hello? Na nashangaa ni nani angebaki pia bila kitu kama amen. Maana hata huyo pastor mwenye anakuongoza kusema amen angekuwa alichomo. So, ni kumaliza mungu wako na agenda ingine kubwa. Halo? Mungu wako na agenda ingine kubwa. Zaidi ya kuwenda mingu. Halo? Mutakeza tingiza jure mwambi wajwa kuwenda mingu. Mwambi ya kubwa na agenda kubwa zaidi ya kiyo. Mwana Yesu wa sifiwe. Hey, mwana Yesu wa sifiwe. He want you to serve him. Amen. He want you to invest in him. Hallelujah. As you live. Hey, praise the name of the living God. And we only do this by faith. Akuna jengine. It's by faith. Tunatoa mapesa mingi. Tunakuja kwa kesha, tunalala kwa balini. Tunajini machakuna kama kesha. Tunafuata tuku hini. By faith. By faith. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Number six. Faith help us to trust God for the impossible. Faith help us to trust God for the impossible. Imani kusaidia kumtumainia mungu kwa yale ya siyo weze kana. Amen. Mana kuna mambo mengine kamisa kamisa. Hai weze kani kama nadabu. Hai weze kani. Kama hii situation ya saa. Hii hai weze kani. Hata manatari wamesema hii weze kani. Wamesema ukipitisha for 5 years, umeenda mwana kusi. Wewe mweza. Hello? This is a situation that is impossible. Sasa sana, C45, ameenda na umutu. Hako na nangu. Na mzea na kwa ushukuta, tunatazamia kuwa na mwana. This is impossible. Lakini manika nasema, haka muamini ya liya haiti. Maana ni mwana. Na kwa ye, the impossible are possible. Praise the name of the living God. Kuna mambo mengine ni impossible. 
Hello? Kuna mambo mengi hata hata wanadamu ukienda kudiscuss au anakuambia hiyo maybe God. Hello? Maybe who? And the only way it is faith to see the impossible becoming possible. Sara na Abra walikuwa wamepitwa na mia kanguza. But they believe na maana nasema without weapon. Hello? Because he was so much convinced that God is able to do what he has said. Praise the name of the Lord. But I shall speak. Amen. Na ukweli ni kwamba Sara akiwa na 90 alishika mimi. Hello? Alikuwa mtamzito. Na akavaa maternity dress. Ile free dress hizo anatembea kijiji shosho wa night na tumbo iko huko bado na tikoya kubarikiwa it is faith that makes you to trust god for the impossible when i say spirit for the impossible hata magonjwa mengine wanakuambia kabisa kabisa na manama hii ndio kwa hii huwezi na hata kabisa wewe una test jirani yako ni na hata kwa kijiji yenu kuna watu kama wengine wameenda ukweli wa Yesu but by faith we trust God for the impossible praise the name of the living God we trust God for the impossible mark 9 verse 23 nimekaa kwa kuniweza mark 9 verse 23 that's why your faith is important amen maana kuna vitu tunataka na kwa maisha ya impossible haleluya you just need to operate by faith and you see the works of god praise the name of the living god what is that spirit what is that spirit yeah kuna vitu vingine utaenda madaktari waangalie kwa hiyo biti yao wakwambie na manama wewe ni waangoji wewe ni it's only faith that will take you out of there praise the name of the living god what is that spirit hey what is that spirit dada moja nilisoma tu story alikuwa amefanya usharati miaka mingi ni usharati prostitution Vanessa Spirit prostitution ukahaba miaka mingi na ilifika mahali akaamua kutoa uterus yake akatoa kwa sababu sasa amefanya maogosho sasa amechoka akaamua sasa the best thing is to do uterus ili nisishike mimba tena Praise the name of the living God. Praise the name of the living God. Na unajua God is a merciful God. Mungu ni Mungu wa huruma. Baada ya miaka mingi tu huruma za Mungu zikamgonga. Akatubu akageuka akaokoka akatuja kanisa. Dada mzuri mrembo akupendeza. Haleluya. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Akaingia kanisa. Akaendelea kukua. Ndugu moja akaonekaniwa akamwona. How many sister you know you sleep eh in your honor let us pray let us pray let us pray come on here dada akacheka sana akamwambia ungejua mimi ni nani hata ungejiuliza if you only know how my life is akamwambia mimi i don't care mimi na siye mungu ameniambia wewe ni wangu dada akamtolea ushuhuda akamwambia what happened na vile amejaribu na vile alitoa hiyo na sasa yeye ameokoka kwa ile ni mimi mambo ya hivi nyama patano na ndugu akamwambia sawa but i believe god yeye amenimiza wewe ndio wa na ndio wa dada akasalenda akasema aishi kama mungu anasema basi mimi ni nani praise the name of the living god tu tuendeleka maisha na ukikosa watoto usisumbue please Nimesema kwa Mungu kama mimi nimeke bila mwingine ndio kwetu. Mungu akamwambia don't care. Yeye Mungu hapo. Do you know what? Baada ya kuona after 3 months she was pregnant. Baada ya miezi tatu alikuwa pregnant. Yeye mwenyewe hakuwa mtu. Akarudi kwa yule daktari aliyemtoa yule daktari akamwambia ulitoa ama ilikuwa ni mwao. Akamwambia ulitoa hata ukatoka. But she is pregnant because faith makes the impossible possible unajua mungu hapo na spare 
na kila kitu kwa mwili wako unajua ukitaka spare part ya Toyota you go to the people of Toyota na ukitaka spare part of your body you go to God he's your creator so you go kwa kwa na imani ambaye ilifanya atrust God for the impossible to be possible praise the name of the living God dada hapo na hiyo imani lakini huyu ndugu ambaye alikuwa he had a faith hallelujah ambaye alikuwa anamwambia i jealous god can still do something god can still do something kama alibarikiwa na watoto kadhaa lakini hiyo tres kweli ni mama ilikuwa imetolewa na ikatupo lakini do you know what Mungu ame specialize for impossibility. Hiyo ndio specialty ya Mungu. He deal with those impossible situations. Hallelujah. Ile hali watu wanaangalia wanasema hii hauwezi toka ndani. God is able to deal with that. If you can say to Jesus, everything is possible for him who believes. Amen. If you can say to Jesus, everything is possible for him who believes praise the name of the living god ah itikiza kumwambia hold on on your faith mwambie shikilia imani yako kuna situation zitakuja ambazo zinakaa impossible amen it is only the faith that you have hallelujah that will help you to overcome praise the name of the living god bwana yesu asifiwe the impossible are there in this life amen bwana yesu asifiwe there are impossible things <laughs> in this life but by faith we trust in god and he help us to overcome it praise the name of the living god but as if you number seven faith help us to focus on the future and pursue it faith help us to focus on the future and pursue it ni imani utusaidia kuona siku za usoni na tunazifuata amen Hello? Tunaona siku za usoni. Tunaona siku zichana. And we pursue them. Amen. Maana kinasema kwa imani watu hawa waliishi kama wageni, wakitazamia mti mwenye kujenga na kuunguni ni Mungu. Amen. Kwa imani they pursued the future. Praise the name of the living God. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Na asubuhi nilikuwa ninasema future tu sio ya mbinguni peke yake hata ya maisha ya duniani ni vibaya sana sasa hii una nguvu you use everything you get kwa raha bwana asifiwe bwana asifiwe bwana 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 asifiwe unajua mtendo ukienda kwa ile masimu wako naye anatoa hivi baka unashangaa unaweza nodi hii ni simu tu They use a lot kujifurahisha. But unajua Mungu anakupea sasa hivi na nguvu so that you may also see the future. And start doing something because the future is coming. Hello? The future is Au unakuwa na hiyo nguvu miaka yote? Wewe unajua sasa hivi asubuhi kubwa kubwa utashangaa ukiwa mzee unatumia kikamusi. Utakuwa na kabao Utoa kesto. Hello? Ya vile ulikuwa kijana ulikuwa unabadilisha masimu. Sasa umezeeka kibogoyo na bogoro. Natoka siku nyingine unajaribu kwa namba hata ionekane. Saidia kijana. Ona hata ionekane. Maana ulikula ujana wako. Wasipo kutoa kesho. Angalia jana mwambie kuzeeka umezeeka. Mwambie si hata ni juu si tumekuwa mchana. Angalia vile sasa
Halo? Jangan tujuba mahal. Haleluya. Kalau kutuwa mzee unataka tayari kula. Na kaona na wangu 
hiyo na yeye na amen akasema afadhali niachane na dhambi na nasa za misri nimfuate huyo praise the name of the bana Yesu asifiwe kuna maamuzi mengine ya gharama sana inafanywa tuna watu wa imani inafanywa tuna watu wa nini wa imani praise the name of the living bana Yesu wa imani ni moto imewashwa mara saba moto imewashwa kuliko kawaida na vijana watatu wako hapa na sababu nani chada kimesha kaendelea kwa sisi ya binadamu pale bana uliza ni nani atawaokoa na niko na yao wanamwambia Mungu atatuokoa alafu anatoa nasema hata kama atatuokoa hata kama sisi tuko tayari tuchomeke that was a very costly choice hello very costly imagine ungechukua hapo aanze kushuka baada ya kile Mungu anaweza kuokoa na hata kosa kuokoa they are ready kushuka
In fact, that was the remarkable man at the top of the Tupac and he fought for a minimum. Sasa tena atore, inawambia tuwa mungu. Tuwa minimum. Wame. Ati ya mungu kuyo kutoto. Sasa wame agro. Wajipo nasema agro, akui. Ako, lakini ya wanyo kini? Akui. Wame let us believe God. We need to see the power of God. God has all powers. Where is the name of the living God? And if you don't have two weeks, you can't get that. You can't get that. You can't get that. You can't get that. Leo, I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to talk to Leo. Hallelujah. Now I'm going to talk to you. Look at this. We chose to believe God. Hello? We chose to believe God. And if I'm going to talk to you, I'm going to talk to you. Amen. In the fact, I'm going to talk to you. 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 But that's a spirit. But that's a spirit. I was so much concerned. Nika mpikia sifu kwa msa, yani, unakua hiko na uniyami. Haka cheka cheka kwa 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 msa. Nishino na kwa mbia na kwa kwa. Kwa mbia amini mungu wacha kwa mbia. Praise the name of the Lord. Wana is a spirit. Wana is a spirit. Situation of meetings of my share, sometimes they just need God's power. Mana we are powerless in ourselves. And it's by faith, we experience the demonstrations of God's power in our situations. Praise the name of the living God. Last but not least, faith help us to endure difficult times. Faith help us to endure difficult times. Imana kusaidia kusaidiri nyakati mungu. Nyakati mungu. Nyakati mungu. Inamisha uso wako kwa mbibu wana nisaidi Kwa mba nitendele kuwa na imani Nitendele ya kukutegene Angea na wana kwa mbibu wana nisaidi Kwa mbibu wana nisaidi Kwa mba sita achiria imani yangu Nitazidi kuilinga Nitazidi kuisimamia Nione ukuu na uaminifu wako Katika maisha yangu In the name of Jesus In the name of Jesus Oh my father my God Ya tulo musika ya nalababu You have said this Lord To stand us up in the name of Jesus that we may continue to hold on on our faith, that we may continue to believe and to trust in you because you never fail and you don't know how to be fair in the name of Jesus, oh God help each other of us, oh God that we will continue to be strong in our faith, that we will not waver in our faith, in the name of Jesus, we will continue to believe in your word, in your power, in your promises oh God, because you are faithful and you are
kwa wale mmetusikiza God bless you so much kwa kutusikiza na kama haujaokoka ningependa uombe maombi hayo na Bwana Yesu ataingia katika maisha yako sema Bwana Yesu mimi ni mwenye dhambi na ulikufa kwa sababu ya wenye dhambi na leo ninaweka imani yangu kwako uniokoe na unisamehe na mizani na kuanzia leo uwe bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako asante kwa kuniokoa kwa jina la Yesu Kristo nimeomba na kuamini Mungu akubariki wewe ambao umeomba maombi hayo karibu katika nyumba ya Bwana na ili tuendelee kukua katika imani God bless you amen